Hey y'all, it's Janae. Welcome back to my channel. And we are back with another try on haul. You can see my tags from Burlington. Okay, so before we jump into the video, I got a surprise for you. Boy. Okay, so here are the rules for the giveaway. You must like, comment, and subscribe on this video. And once we make it to 500 subscribers, I am going to go through the comments and use this website I found to generate a winner. That winner will get a $50 gift card, either a Visa gift card or a Target gift card. Um, I will communicate once that with the winner to see which one you would prefer. If it was me, I would prefer a Target gift card because I'm in Target all the time anyways, but you might not go to Target. So like I said, either a Visa gift card or a Target gift card once we make it to 500 subscribers. So the rules are very simple. All you have to do, like I said, is like, comment, and subscribe. On this video, leave a comment down below. What is your favorite outfit? Have you ever shopped at Burlington before? Go ahead and leave me some feedback of some videos that you would like to see um, so I can pick a winner. Okay, now that we have the giveaway out of the way, um, I wanna tell you guys about this series that I'm starting on my channel. So I am a person that loves going to the gym. I am pretty much at the gym five days out of the week. Um, and one of the most important parts about being at the gym is having the right um, outfits to wear so that you feel confident, so that you are able to perform those activities. Like your gym clothes matter. It's not just something that you wanna throw on and just go to the gym and you know, not put any thought in because the quality, it matters. It, it determines how you feel. And for me, my gym clothes are a big motivating factor to actually get me in the gym. So I know we're approaching the new year and I know we have people that are either in the gym already and you're working on your fitness goals or you might be, you know, trying to start your fitness goals for the new year. And I personally need new um, fall and winter workout clothes. So I said, hey, why not start this um, video on my channel? It's going to be helpful for me to get some new workout clothes and hopefully I can help somebody out there find some good workout clothes. Now going into Burlington, what I can say is there, it wasn't as easy to find pieces um, as I, well, I really went in there with kind of like no expectations. Um, it's hard to find workout clothes in store. I will say that we have a lot of online retail stores offering um, workout clothes, but it's, it's very difficult to actually go in the store and find some workout clothes. So I just started with Burlington. Like I said, this is a series. I am gonna try some online places as well. I'm gonna try different um, brands as far as like low end, high end. So we're gonna see a variety of things. And I'm really trying to go through myself to see like what pieces do I actually wanna keep? Because my workout drawer is out of control. Like I have things in there at the very bottom that I hardly ever wear. So I'm really asking myself like what type of pieces do I like and what type of pieces do I know like I'm actually not gonna wear at all. Okay, and one of those things that I really found is things that are just like too busy I hardly ever reach for them. Either like I need a solid top and like maybe a printed bottom, but most, that's really the most that I'll do. I really like to have like solid pieces. I find myself like those are the types of pieces that I'm gravitating towards. And I really think my overall style is just changing because I really just like a whole bunch of neutrals. So that's what you're gonna see. So enough talking, let me go ahead and show you the pieces, which I have a few pieces on, and I'm gonna go ahead and tell you my thoughts. All right, y'all, so here is my first um, outfit that I have. I do have on matching top and bottoms, which I'll get to in just a second. But um, I do, I did find this like little active wear jacket and it's gray and black. It was $12.99 and once I take it off, I will tell you the brand. It comes with like I, you know, the little thumb holes that I know people like. Um, I purchased it in a size medium and I really feel like I would like a size small in this. Um, my first thoughts about this, this is my first time trying on all of these things. I did not try on anything in the store. Um, my first thoughts about this, it's okay. Um, I don't know if I'm in love with it or if I would reach for it that often. So I would say it's just okay. The quality is nice, it's thick. 
Um, I feel like this is a material that if you wanted to keep it on as you worked out, you would be okay. Um, it's thick enough for, you know, the transition from the gym to the car if you just strictly want it as like a quick gym jacket to gym jacket to grab. So I, my thoughts, it's okay. Not in love, but it's okay. Now, underneath, I have this two-piece set the bottoms were $12.99 and I purchased these in a medium and I will have the brands for all of these in the description box so that way once you go into your Burlington if you're interested you can look for the brand um and I also have the matching sports bra top these were not um like as I said in the store I was just browsing through the, through the legging section in the sports bra section and I just so happened to find these. I actually have a couple. Um, so here is the, um, put this over there. So here is the first set that I have. I also purchased the sports bra. I also got this in a size medium. Now this sports bra, like, I apologize if you, if you hear my daughter, she's downstairs watching TV. So you might hear her in the background. If so, comment down below, say, hey, Jay. Um, but anyway, so this top, I purchased it in a size medium. I actually really do like this. I like where it falls on here. And like I said, the price for this was, not sure if I said the price, but the price for this was originally $38, but at Burlington they had it for $11.99. And I actually really like this. Like I like where it falls. The leggings, um, so a couple of things that I, either like or dislike about leggings. One, the material. Can I actually move in them? Can I squat in them? Like, can I do jump? Like, that's what I look for. And I would say this material is pretty good. I don't think that these are gonna slide down when I'm ready. I think that the material is pretty good. Um, it does have pockets on them, which I do like. That is convenient, you know, to have a little pocket to slip, you know, if you're if you like to run errands after you know you go to the gym, maybe running to Target, wherever it is, nice to have somewhere where you can kind of just like slip your car, um, those types of things. So I do like that. I do like having the um, option of having pockets in your leggings. So I do like that. Um, I love this color of gray. I think it is very cute. Um, here is the back of it. Can you guys see? Um, am I in love? Will I keep this set? I don't need a whole bunch of clothes to just crowd my workout um, drawer. So I don't know if I'm in love with it. I, on a scale of one to 10, I would give this a seven. And with that being said, it's it's in the maybe pile right now. Right now, So you comment down below, would you keep this? Do you like this set? Is it something that you would wear? Um, comment down your thoughts. Like I said, I will have the brand down below. But if you have this brand in your Burlington, pick them up. It's very thick. They have like this thick waistband right here, which is good for the tummy control. Like if this area is like a concern for you, which on me, you know, this is a little concern for me. Um, but I like, oh my goodness, I am so in love with these. And I'm so glad that I purchased these. Like they feel like they are going to stay up. Like I can... Mm, mm. They feel like they're not going anywhere. I love these. They feel like buttery soft on the skin. Oh my goodness. I love these. I love this high thick waistband. Um, I probably would not wear it with this sports bra. I mean, it still looks good with this too. I would probably wear a white one with it um, though. Just me kind of like thinking in my head, I feel like I would wear it with a white one. But oh my goodness, this quality for $12.99. So good. Now it will be interesting as we have these series, like as we kind of go up in brand, 
to see if like these $12.99 leggings, if I can really notice a difference from like your higher end leggings. But these, I like these, go get these. <laughs> next two pieces um once again matching sports bra and leggings found these in two different sections now this sports bra it looks like the gray one that i had on in the previous clip but the material feels different the gray one was kind of more structured and stiff and this tan nude color one is more stretchy and i actually prefer the material that this is made out of um, over the gray one not really sure um, you know I have to look at the tag to see like what the difference is in the material but they look exactly the same they're made by the same brand but this one just feels different um, also we have the nude leggings once again they are made by the same brand but the, the quality of this one feels it feels different it feels more stretchy and I much I prefer this much more than the gray one um, now the color I love it and this set, again, I'm kind of in limbo. I don't really know if I would keep it and actually wear it. That's my thing. We're trying to eliminate things that we are not going to wear. I'm looking at myself and I'm telling myself this. But if that's a problem for you, same thing to you, sis. If you're not going to wear it, get rid of it. Okay, so um, I, ugh, I don't know. I don't love it. So because me saying that I don't love it, I feel like I shouldn't keep it, but I love the color. I love the color. Um, these leggings are very, very high waisted. Um, this, I mean, it looks cute. It will motivate me to go to the gym, which I like going to the gym anyways, but I don't, do I love it? Ooh, I don't know. This is kind of one that I'm, um, in between y'all comment down below like would you keep this or not like I, I don't know I love the color I don't know what would y'all do comment down below so I'm looking at the the clip before like I'm looking at the actual footage and um, I'm looking at where and I think these are going to be a no for me and here's why like I feel like this part right here is kind of too big in this in this area and I don't like it um, I'm not sure if I mentioned the price of these but this was $12.99 $11.99 yeah I don't think I'm gonna keep this one I mean not a bad price but like I don't like this extra part right here I know it's gonna aggravate me so this one is a no mm -mm. y'all if I started with these pants it wouldn't have been a haul if I started with these pants it would not have been a haul I wish y'all could have just saw the workout that I had trying to get in these pants and they up and they stuck exactly where they at. Like, I cannot pull these up anymore. They're the same brand as the other pants, just a different color. And that's why it's important to try things on. Even if they're the same brand, same size, sometimes the sizing is just inconsistent. Like, I don't understand, like, what's up with that. These pants are stuck on my thighs. Like, if I do one wrong move, I feel like they're going to split. And I was like, these are black leggings. I really thought that, you know, they would just kind of be like a basic, like, oh, yeah, I'm going to like them. Wrong. Do not like these whatsoever. Like, they are stuck, so uncomfortable. I don't know why this size medium fits different than the other size medium, but these are a complete fail. And I wanted to show you guys, like, it, it looks kind of okay. Um, in the camera from what I can tell because it's black but they fit horrible like they're just stuck all of this right here it's so much space right here because I, I literally cannot pull them up $11.99 and I actually got these in a small I like these these cute they did something they redeemed themselves because them black pants oh no they <laughs> mm -mm. okay them black them black pair no but these they redeemed themselves I love them they're so cute love the color now I definitely think I'm going to keep these and the ones that were in a similar color 
those can go back like i said they have the extra space these do not have these they feel like they are going to stay i can see myself reaching for this so i really really like these um and like i said check the description box for the brand so that way you can go into your burlington to see if you see them but i actually really really like these these are cute. these these are cute very comfortable Somewhere when no one can find you Mansion out in the sticks with nothing around you Katy, Texas, Dallas, Texas You know a different environment Cause you got desires I know, I know Cause you got desires I know, I know Guys, here we have our last piece This little zip up um, Cropped hoodie well not hoodie like zip little fleece um it's not super thick but it is kind of thick i think that i would just kind of really wear this like in the gym and take it off um it is very cute though it has a little zipper right here and it is functional i believe yeah it's functional so it does have a place where you can put different things in there um and then it has like a little space right here so i like this this is cute you know this is cute you can kind of roll up with somebody like what you what you this is cute i like this um so i am gonna keep this as well um you can just throw this on with black grays you know neutrals my theme right now um what i'm really liking so i do like this i'm gonna keep this nice fit i purchased this in a size medium um it is it's not super crop it's a nice length um not really much to say about it but i do like it it has the neck like this if i wanted to zip it up if it's super chilly outside or, you know, you can kind of unzip it. It's up to you how you wear it. But I actually do really like this. So this is cute. Um, this was a win. on Burlington should you go purchase from there are they good with, with workout clothes and on a scale of one to ten I'm gonna rate each brand on a scale of one to ten and for Burlington I give it a six like I found some cute pieces but overall um in store they had a lot of things that were very colorful very kind of tacky looking to me um kind of cheap looking so if you go in there um the, the price point is pretty, like you can find some good things and it has a great price point um, some of my tips, if you go in there, kind of stay away from things that have like all of the brands on there. They look cheap to me. That's my personal opinion. Um, there's like super colorful things. Um, they look very cheap to me. I really wouldn't recommend getting those um, if you're trying to look for like nice quality pieces, you know, things that you'll actually wear. Like I don't like those types of things. So if that's you, you know, do you. But like I said, I don't really like those pieces and it kind of lessens the, the overall look. Um, in my personal opinion, um, so I would look, start with like the, the brands that I have linked below. The material on these are great. Um, they're not see-through. So I would recommend these pieces, but as a whole, will I be making frequent trips to Burlington? Probably not. Um, I'm just, I'm not super impressed with what I got. Now, all of the things that I did purchase today was $150. So if you like some of these pieces and you're starting and you wanna start your workouts, um, collection $150 for like what five pieces is really good um, some leggings like as we will see once I get um, you know more up in price range you can easily purchase a pair of leggings for $80 so $150 for all the pieces that I got really isn't it's a really good deal it's not bad at all um, but me personally I don't think that I'll be frequenting Burlington anytime soon for some more workout clothes um, so like I said don't forget about the giveaway Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my video. Comment down below the pieces that you like, the ones that are a no for you. Um, go ahead and comment those things down below. Also, comment down some brands that you would like to see. I have some goodies going on in my head and some orders that have actually already been placed. But go ahead and comment down below some things that you would like to see on my channel. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.